If you are self-employed and you're going to be paying self-employed income taxes come tax time, then you could be earning additional money every single month by having that money saved in a high interest savings account, not a regular savings account. I'm going to show you the best one to use. That is my favorite. Just from moving my tax money that I'm going to have to be saving for tax time anyway, I earn anywhere from $100 to $300 per month additional for from doing nothing just by saving that tax money, which I would already be setting aside anyway. If you're saving money for self-employed income taxes in a regular bank account, then you absolutely must switch over to this high yield savings account right away. This account has no fees, no minimum opening balance. It is not going to cost you anything to keep your money here. The interest rate for annual percentage yield is 4.35%. Compare that to a typical bank's interest rates and it is clear to see that you are throwing money away if you have your money saved in a typical bank. My personal favorite to keep my tax money in is my Ally Savings account. Now this is not a sponsored video, but I do have an affiliate link that you could use down below in order to set up your own savings account and receive a bonus of up to $125. One reason that I really like using an Ally account is that it allows you to organize your savings account using what they call buckets. Essentially, you can set set aside specific amounts for each category that you're saving in. So if you are saving for income taxes and sales tax, you can separate out those two different types of amounts that you're setting aside so you can continually monitor and track how much you need for each. You can also set up automatic recurring transfers. So this comes in really handy if you forget to set aside that tax money and you wanna just have an automated estimate of what you think you're going to owe it being transferred automatically. There are no monthly maintenance fees or minimum balance requirements. There is a limit of 10 withdrawals per statement cycle, but because I'm only using this account for taxes, that doesn't matter to me. The interest is compounded daily make sure that you are regularly transferring the amount that you think you will owe at tax time for, for self-employment tax, which is 15.3% of your net income and your federal and state income taxes. Always contact a tax professional to get an accurate estimate of what you should be transferring. But if you have absolutely no idea what to transfer, a good rule of thumb that many business owners use is estimating 30% of your income to save for taxes. You will be earning a higher amount of interest on this savings that just has to sit there anyway. So you might as well put it in an account that is going to earn you more interest than your average savings account. 